A Song For Us captures people's experiences of a unique period in our lives, bringing people together to create, sing and share music on an interactive map of the UK. More than 15 composers have been commissioned to write a new song for community choirs and bands in 15 counties. These have been filmed and are streamed on asongforus.org. Alongside these, the public can upload songs they have written or that have a special meaning. Songwriting workshops have been taking place around the country and a series of songwriting tutorials are available on the website. A Song For Us is a musical time capsule of our personal and shared experiences of the pandemic. My name is Ned. Um, I'm a musician in a band called Normanton Street. I was given a brief to write a song about the area and I thought that it'd be good to collaborate as much as possible. It's, it's great to, to write about local, local feelings about the area and obviously lockdown was for a lot of people and we thought, yeah, let's put a tune together to, to sort of help collate these feelings. One of the things that we've done as part of this project is to go to, to different communities, putting on, putting on music workshops for people to write their songs which defined lockdown for them and that's what informed the writing process and I sort of sent them feelings to Phoebe Freyer to Afro the Poet and to Bobby Johnson and then they, they artistically sort of added their source onto it. Bringing the community back together, it's just amazing, just hearing everyone's opinions about that lockdown and um, hearing some, you know, some solution, it's just lovely. It brings people together and it brings joy, it, it's very uplifting in part of the community when you bring people together in any sense really, but especially with singing to work with people who are not used to writing songs for a living and see what ideas they come up with and, the, and the, they came up with some incredible stuff actually. Music and lyrics can say what you're feeling when you haven't been able to put the words to it yourself. So you kind of feel seen and heard through songs or through any sort of creative art form. You can see more of yourself through it when people share those vulnerable experiences. Had to let go of what we'd known. Too early I'd grown. So sick of these fools. Can't be the new normal. Next slide, please, because this slide is awful. But it's I... just coming up with something, something new, and creating, creating something new out of, I guess, a, a bad situation, really. But it was us in that line, free in a room that forced my hustle and grind. No money in palms, just family and time. Brighton Dome got involved because we wanted to be part of something hopeful and positive after such a difficult year. And we also love the idea of this project and the fact that it's a snapshot of a moment in time in an extraordinary part of, of, of our lives. And though we don't know or understand what the future may comprise, I hope you know you can hold my hand, but let's be safe and sanitise. They've created an absolutely beautiful song and it works so well bringing in a local school choir as well. So we're working with Van Dien School Choirs and their choir leader, David Berliner. The positive impact of something like this on young people is showing them actually about the real world of, of making music, the professionalism that goes with that, that kind of close community collaboration and the you know seeing all these different people working behind the scenes from the camera crew to the sound crew and the artists and musicians bringing it all together too far, too far, too far. I really liked coming here and working with the Dome and all the different artists. I thought it was a really good experience to inspire young people like me um, to pursue their careers and dreams. I just think it's amazing to sing in this huge space and just perform with all these people that you wouldn't usually meet. A lot of my friends were involved and it was a way for us to become closer. The fusion of all these sounds is extraordinary and we're, we're so, so proud to be hosting them on our stage today. If I 